audio and mixer right there. Oh my gosh! Welcome back to the channel, everybody. I'm Crandall. Y'all are watching the Eldritch Fam. Man, I will tell you what, it feels like peace has been restored to the farm. If you guys didn't know, we got rid of our billy goat, Zan. He was just causing a whole bunch of ruckus, headbutting our kids, stuff like that. So we decided it was best to move him along to a new farm. And now Maverick has just absolutely loved being outside and playing and hasn't been worried for his life. So we're excited about it. All of the animals are doing good. We got him fed this morning. It's going, it's now the evening, but I will tell you, actually, I'm going to let Maverick tell you guys what we're doing in today's video. We went in a Christmas tree. What are we going to use to build it? A saw. A saw, and what are we, uh, what else? And then. What wood? The other wood right there, she said. But what kind of wood is that? It's a two by four. It's a two by four. Good job, buckaroo. So that's right, we're going to be showing you guys an extremely easy, actually I haven't done it yet, I just think it's going to be easy, an extremely easy DIY Christmas tree decoration. This can be like for your front porch or uh, I guess really wherever you want to put it. But we're going to use, I think, three 2 by 4s and uh, some screws and then Marcy's going to paint it and we're going to show you guys the entire process, how to do it. So if you guys want to do it and you want some cool front porch decorations for cheap and easy, I think 2 by 4s are like... Just over $3 a piece right now. So you're talking less than $10 for two Christmas trees that you can stick on your front porch. I'm going to show you guys how we're going to do it. Like I said, I have never done this before. We're going off of a picture of a plans that Marcy sent me. And so that's what we're going to go with. This is what we're building here. I will leave a link down below with like all of the dimensions and everything like that in case you guys want to build these. But I've got my two new 2 by 4s I wanted to use 2 by 4s that looked good. Uh, so we're going to need these two and one that's a half two by four that's an old one because I only bought two. Um, oh, we got this one actually that isn't too bad. So maybe we'll use this if this is straight. There we go. So because we're building two of these, we're going to double everything. Um, so we've got to cut eight boards that are 12 inches long from point to point with a 22.5 degree angle. That's what we're gonna do now. All right, let's set this saw to 22.5 degrees. And throw a board. And we do that a bunch of times. Now, when you do this, you got to pay attention to the angles and which way they go. So this is going to be the base of the Christmas tree. So we're cutting them both so the angles are the same direction. Where these first ones were the opposite direction. So these two cuts are parallel. And these ones are not parallel. So I decided to start separating these into the two different trees. We've got that one that's going to be painted. I don't know if she's leaving one raw and one painted. Uh, that's kind of what the pictures show. So we'll do one that, that one will be painted because it's got different color two by fours. This one will not be painted. So I figured out something cool here. So these pieces, as you cut them, if you flip the board over, you can get them to do exactly what you want. So we needed a 45 degree angle on two of these. So I went ahead, cut the 45 degree angle and then flipped the board over and did a 22. So I flipped it over, did the 22. Now I cut the 22. Now I can do the same thing put the angle at a 45 again, cut the 45, flip it, put it at 12 or at 22, cut it at 22. So you're not wasting any board or any time really setting stuff up. It's just super, super easy if you just flip the board and change your angle. Well, it's getting dark on us. We better uh, hurry up. Uh, I have both of the trees done. That was the extra two by four. So honestly, we were only like that big of a piece short. So pretty much two two by fours plus like a little two foot section. Look at your bike. How are you doing? It broke my head. It did? Yeah. Okay. Oh yeah, it's got a hole in it? Yeah, let me get a new one. Uh, maybe not. Yeah. A new handlebar? 
A new grip? So. Yeah. From Sam's Club. Oh, you think Sam's Club has it? Walmart. Walmart? Maybe they have it. So we're going to go ahead and get these put together, laid out. Yeah, I'm not sure how they screw together, so I'm going to look at the plans really quick, and then I'll let y'all know how it goes together. Well, we have run into a slight problem. I only have three inch screws. I need two and a half inch screws. So we're going to try this and see if it's going to work. I don't think it's going to. I think the screws are going to be too long and they're going to stick out. But I'm going to try my best to kind of like angle them a little bit so that they won't stick out. But definitely use two and a half inch screws. Even two and three quarter would work. Um, I just don't have them. Okay, we can throw that in the trash. Now we got to figure out how this dang thing goes together. I think this one goes like that. Okay. What are you doing? I'm building the Christmas tree. What's in the like house with you? In the house with you. Okay. Uh, I did this one. I'm going to do this one. I should do this one in the bottom of it. Of a Christmas tree. Oh no, I got them all mixed up. Now I don't know which one goes where. I know this one goes on the bottom. And then... This one goes. This one, and then this one. Look, it's a Christmas tree. You want a Christmas tree. Yeah, can you see it? Yeah. Okay, and then... Those. Okay. Like this. Then that one. And then this one. Um, this no. one. Yeah, then this one. Okay, like that. What? And then. I need this one. These two are the same, so I'm missing one of the long ones. Okay, beep beep. What? Uh, oh, this one. This one's Yeah, mine. let's see. This one's mine. Yeah, that one. Okay. I still, I still play some there we go, look. Do you see the Christmas tree, Abby? Oh, we look at that. To, we can put it, maybe we are done, and we put it up. Yeah, we will. Okay, wait, that one goes over there. So, I may be missing one, the bottom board here. I might have just got them mixed up. So, I'm going to go ahead and just screw this together, just like this. Oh, wait. What's going on here? This, ha, there we go. This is supposed to be oh, the bottom. What? And then this. It goes there. Goes there. There we go. I thought I had it right. Why is that one over Whoa, careful. Peace. All right. Daddy's going to drill them all together, okay? Okay, no out. No, not really. This one's no out. Should we try the first screw? Uh -huh. Let's try these and see if we can get them to work. Thankfully, this this one, they can be long, and it doesn't matter because they uh, have the whole board to go into. Okay. What's the Walmart one? Yeah, I got it. Do you know what that's called? Yeah. That's a, what is that? It's a nut. Nope. It's a... It's a drill. It's a drill bit. A drill bit? Yep. Oh, it's a drill bit. Do you have the blue one on here? Yeah, I do. What? I got one for you. Okay. Okay. 
I'll go ahead and just put the base on here too. May as well, right? We should put this one up there. It's barely poking through, y'all. That's What's this not for? great. What's this for? That's for the pressure washer. What? Yeah, crazy. It's in here. What the heck? So I did forget to put those in on an angle. So I got to remember on these other ones to put them in at an angle. I should put mine at an angle. Okay, let's, yeah, put this. Wait, we need to put this one here. I got to measure this. Make sure it's gonna line up. I can break this big building like this. See this huge big building? I need that. So I think I'm gonna screw this one together first, and then we'll be able to measure off the middle to get the right measurement for uh, how high those need to be separated, basically. And this one, we shouldn't have any problem with the three inch either. Two screws? Oh, yeah, sure. Mm -hmm. Yep, the big ones. Oh, just two. One, two, perfect. I need the monster you want. Okay. This is tiny one. There you go. Perfect. Thank you, Maverick. Oh. You don't need this one. That's all right. No, we don't. We don't want to put that one over there right now. What? Yeah, Daddy, don't need it right now. I need to. My dad. There we go. I'm going to equip my tree, Daddy. You're building one too. It worked, Mavi. What? Okay. We're almost done with one Christmas tree. What? Let's line this up. See. I'm putting yours. For me. Okay. Then I'm making a small Christmas tree. So it goes like that. Okay. Then it goes like that. Then I'm. This one goes like that, that. That looks about right. Uh, that one Two and a quarter. That. That and that. Two and a quarter right there. Oh my gosh. Whoa, what happened? I like the Christmas tree. Oh man. I just sit in it and I just pulled it. Oh, are you okay? Yeah. Okay, good. Put a new one. We need to... Build it again? No, I can't do it. I can't do it. Oh, what? Yeah, it's good. Okay. And then, 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 Oh, wow. It's a Christmas tree. Or a pyramid. Looks like a pyramid or a teepee. It's a Christmas tree. Maybe it's a Christmas tree. Oh, it's a house. A house? Yeah, you're making a Christmas tree and I'm making a house. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, we need a
made that? Huh? Did you make that? I like the clipper tree. Wait, we need the top. Oh. Oh my gosh. That is cool. Who said to see it the bone? Mary keep up. We see your school. Wait, the in the keys? What? Is your school in the keys? Yeah. And then you this side of it and this side of it. And then we stand it up and down that side. No they gotta know we put it up. Yeah. Okay, let me screw this one really fast. Sound good? Yeah. Not a screw. Whoa. Is that Papa? Yeah. Nope. One more screw. One more. Can you get it? Yeah. Well, yo, we got one Christmas tree. No, just one. Oh, none of those are screws. Just a yellow one. Here is what they're supposed to look like. Hopefully Marcy's gonna like that. We might have to go through with the sander and just kinda get off a couple of the rough edges. But overall, I would say that was pretty darn easy. Okay, go under it. Okay, I'll hold that. Go through the Christmas tree. Wow, that was pretty good, Maverick. So, I'm gonna go ahead and build the other one. Trying to get it go straight. Can I build my Christmas tree? Yep, let's build that one. Okay, Mars, we got your Christmas trees done. Come look at them. They're so cute. Mavi built them. Randall's are perfect. Oh, good. Bring it over here. Carry one. Grab it. It's a whole two by four. It's right? as big as you. No, I can't. You you moved it. Keep moving it. Oh, they are so cute. Were they easy? I can't. Yeah, they're pretty easy. I can do it. <laughs> you guys did a, such a good job. Yeah. Yeah, you did. And we didn't make presents. We need to make some presents. Yeah, some linen presents. That'd be pretty cool, huh? That'd be sweet. I want to put them around the Christmas tree. Yeah, put them around the Christmas tree. Should we paint the Christmas tree? No. No, we should leave it wood color. It's nice wood color, huh? You want to hold it? I do want to hold it. It's a heavy. Oh! <sighs> wow! You're right. It is so heavy. So I almost couldn't build them because I didn't have the right screws. I only had three inch and I needed two and a half. But I was able to screw them all at it like an angle, oh, so, so that they didn't stick out. And down this them on this leg. That one fell on that leg. Yeah. Oh, what the heck? Should we go put them on the front porch? For so we got Marcy's other sign here. Christmas, Christmas rug, one. So yeah, I don't know. It might be wet because I washed oh, it off. It probably is. It's probably it just wet. Enough. Yeah. Okay. Those so are pretty gonna, cute. I was gonna paint one green and then stain one. But what do you think? Uh, I don't know. I, I would do that. Like to stand out. I got a drink for you in the car. <gasps> Thanks, Mars. Okay, it is actually the next day, y'all. And Mars, yeah, I had no idea she had a whole bucket of paint, but she's got a whole bucket of paint. I got a whole bucket of paint. Did you find some colors you like? So I have, well, like, this holly branch is a really pretty green, but I only have, like, this much left, and I don't want to go to the store. So I think I'm just going to mix the other two colors of green that I have. And make my own green so that I have enough paint 
I don't want to go to the store. Well, we'll let you guys know how it turns out. Do I'm a little nervous sandwich? about that. No, you're Do I right. Have a you can if you want. My question is, is do I do it like a bright green or do I do it like a medium? Christmas green? I, I don't think so. <laughs> oh, Did you show them like an info pic? No. I showed them the plans, but that was it. Yeah, do it that green. <laughs> I do this green. Like neon. A beautiful color of green maverick. So I do this green on a, on a Christmas tree. I think we're going to do other Christmas trees this color. Well, not this exact one, but what color is this? Brown. Brown. So I did the hard work of putting it together. Marcy's gonna go ahead and decorate it, and she's gonna show you guys what she does. I'm out here with Christmas tree number one. It is cold. It is windy. But let me show you what color of paint we have. This is my color of paint. Um, I mixed two colors in, like two different greens. Added a little bit of white, and then added some water. So it's a little bit more runny. I added the white so it's not as translucent on the wood. Um. I brought out paper towels because, ugh, that, that worm is alive. <sighs> or whatever that is. Ah! Okay, but because it is winter, um, and we've been doing, okay, because it's Christmas time, we've been doing a lot of crafts, and this is the only paintbrush I have because we've used them all. <laughs> So it's going to take a long time. And like I said, I don't want to go to the grocery store. So we're making do with this tiny brush. <laughs> but here we go. Let's see. I'm just going to take it. Now there isn't a front or a back. So if I hate this color, we can just try again. Um, But I think, well, it's kind of dark for you guys. Let me move it. Uh, Hold on. Here we go. Let's see. That's a very like electric green. Um, I'm not sure I love it, but we shall see. I mean, it's bright. Do we like it that bright or do we want it darker? Hmm. And see, like, I'm not painting it thick enough that you can't see like the wood grain through it. I don't know. It comes across darker on the camera, but for me, it's like, it's pretty green. It's, it's like green where I was thinking more like that Christmas tree green. See that? Like those aren't the same color. Um, we're going to jerry rig this a little bit, mix up a different color or add darker paint to it and see if we like that just a smidge better. Kind of let me come inside. I like froze my butt off for the two minutes that I was out there. We're gonna try color number two and see if we like that a little bit more. You guys, it literally looks the exact same. I guess we're going with it. Here we go. Let's paint it and see. I feel like this is gonna take forever. Mommy, do you like it? Oh no, honey. Sorry, sweetheart. Tell everybody what mom is doing. Painting. Painting what? The Christmas tree. What color am I painting it? Green. Is green the color of trees? Yeah. Yeah. What are you doing with your belly? Let me get some paint on. Then I'm going to wipe some off just to give it a little bit more rough look. And I'll show you guys how some of it turns out. I'm going piece by piece. So I'm doing this chunk first. I take some of my paper towel. I've already done it with this piece. And I just like lightly rub off some of the paint so it's not as thick. And gives you kind of this like more of a transparency feel. Makes it feel a little bit more natural than like straight up painted look at it it looks so cute okay you can't see the bottom it looks so cute i'm so excited maverick how do you like it do you reprint the ornament um not yet it has to dry oh and then we can put a wreath do you need painted 
We painted it. We painted the wreath. Oh. Um, we don't need to paint the wreath. Yeah. It's, it's not, it's branches. The branches? Kind of. Oh, we need a gingerbread stick on there. Oh, we, we might do a gingerbread stick on there. I don't know how we're going to decorate this. It looks so cute. Look how cute it they looks! It looks so good! Colonel, you did a great job. Well, thanks. We decided to leave the other one natural. If I decide later on to paint it, I can. But I, I like it. Together like that. I do really like it. So, you did a fantastic job. I think next year, I'll have you add a smaller one. Yeah. So, it'll be a set of three. But... This is perfect for this year. It was super easy to make and adorable on your front porch. I mean, heck, you could even put them like inside your house. Too. Yeah. So where you need a decoration, you could put them. Yeah. It's cold out here though. <laughs> it is. It is pretty cold today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, there you go. There's your how-to on how to make these. Paint them up, decorate them however you want. Could be a fun craft for the kids also to like paint it with you or whatever. So. Thanks for watching. We'll see you guys on the next video.